Yo guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the final episode of Leon Save, where we're going to play the game against Inter Milan in the Europa League final. As I just said, this is going to be the last episode. We're going to quickly run through the squads of players, and then we're going to do the game against Leon. Not Leon, we are Leon against Inter, and sort of see how we've got on. Right, um, quickly, sort of games in between. We played two, beat um, Saint Etienne uh, one nil for late goal by Kersey. We lost 2-0 to Marseille. At this point, they didn't get out of the blocks quick enough. They came in, got two goals. Pfft, couldn't do anything about it. We had a little bit of a poor run in this middle little bit here. Sort of more draws than wins, as you can see. Apart from that, we actually had a decent year. A couple of bad performances near the start, but... Pfft, oh well. In terms of the league, we finished in... When I get the table, so the playoffs, we finished in third. 69 points, um, less than what we did last year, but PSG did more than last year, so we haven't really improved on that. But Monaco, though, we did, yeah, still the same order, just different points gap. Who finished fourth? Uh, nice last year, they finished fifth and they switched around. Yeah, so not been too bad. We did what we aimed to do, which was qualify for the um, qualified Champions League did that didn't do this failed miserably but they wanted to reach the second knockout round we got to the final we're going to play that shortly uh, French Cup doesn't matter and same with Coupe de la Liga it doesn't matter so let's quickly have a look at some of the youngsters first one being Jordi Middow excellent doing really well very pleased he's definitely going to be a top top player he's heading Marking and tackling. Tackling can improve, but his heading and marking are decent. He's not the quickest, but he's still pretty decent for a centre back. Could have been a little bit taller, but again, very, very good centre back. Uh, Gigliotti is definitely more coming into his own. He's definitely doing better now. His first touch, his finishing and composure could both improve as well, but overall, he's a very, very solid player. He's definitely picking up some goals. Um, Nora. He's again doing well, not getting as much football as I was expecting him to, but he's doing well. Very, very good play. He's quick. He can get back cover. It's about as good as you need. Lato, again, well rounded. Very good player. Uh, Lafont, again, decent goalkeeper. Very good for a youngster. He's only 19. He's definitely got room to improve as well and could quite easily reach his potential if he can keep performing. Who else did we bring in? What like youngster wise? Barco. Um, doing okay. He's not come back from an injury. Doing all right, but slowly. Um, Gomez hasn't been doing as well as I was expecting, but he's still a good player. Definitely going to be quality either way. So we'll just see how he gets on. Other than that, I think that's more or less all the youngsters that I brought up to the first team. Been generally quite pleased with them. So yeah. Right, um, there's not much else to really go for, really. Let's get into the game against Inter and see if we can win this. We're going to switch him around. Barker's coming off uh, to pay. Only thing I have noticed is we're playing at Park Olympiacos Leon. It's off the home stadium. We're at home for the final of the Europa League, which I did not know. But that's hopefully going to give us an advantage. But you have no idea in these. So they've got a very strong team, whatever. They're Murillo, Miranda, um, Banega, Candreva, Mario, Perisic, Icardi, Gabriel Barbosa, Jogatic, um, Sampa. They've got a very, very strong team. So we're going to have to be on our top form to get anything from this and really try and have a good um, result. So let's get in. We're going to drop this into um, extended. Let's sort of see if we can get a little bit more out of this game. Hopefully we can. And yeah, you know, saying this is as we've got the ball, Klesi. Oh, he loses at Memphis. Fakir is saved by Handravanovic. That's probably not how you pronounce it, but I'm going for it. Um, this is the last episode of the series, and the next series coming up onto my channel will be for. FM18. I'll have a little bit of a break between this because it's going to be like mid mid end of September. 
So we're going to have like October off as Gillespie just rifles over the top of the bar. Have like October off, sort of reboot, get ready for FM18, and then there we go, straight into the next one. So this is just going to see how we get on as Gigliotti puts in the ball, but it's say blocked by their defender. And Fakir's got a corner, he's going to put it in, headed out by Perisic, back to Fakir though, into Danilo. Can he find a good ball in? No, he's gone to Fakir. Can he get a decent ball in? No, it's another corner for us. And we've got a lot of possession at the minute. We're doing what we do best, keep the ball. As it's headed out, Memphis decides to halt his very lackadaisical run. But it's wiped out by Miranda, so we get a free kick, which we're not going to see. It's up to Perisic from them though. So from the closing down there, it's got to Canair. Whips it back post for Ricard. He's cracked the crossbar. And we were lucky there not to be 1-0 down. And all he had to do was get it on target. And that was going in the back of the net. He just headed that bit to us. Danilo heads out to Nakatoma. He's gone back to Brogovic into Kanir. Gaspar does work well to win that. As it's coming up 25 minutes in. And we've only really seen a few highlights. Lato's wanted Danilo. All that to, I thought that was going to Gigliotti, but apparently not. Gaspar heads it. It's just bouncing off player to player at the minute. Mamana, Midel, Lato, into Memphis. He's got some space to run. Where's he going? Into Klesi. Shoots. He's put it in the top corner. A circulating goal from distance. And what a way to get it as well. In the Europa League final. Lovely pass into Klesi. He just goes forward. Uses the man in front of him as a sort of wall. And just hits it. Keeper should do better. It's a decent height for him. But it's in the back of the net. And we're 1-0 up in the final of the Europa League. Is this going to be the first trophy we win in this series? And first and last trophy actually. And it be the Europa League final. As time's now just ticking by, 31 minutes in. Long walk to Kondreva, but Lato's going to go up for it. Midal heads it out, but it's dropped back down to them. Mamana heads it out, Danilo gets it, it's into Memphis. Yeah. Long walk top looking for Gigliotti, who almost gets in, but Miranda does get back. He's a little bit, probably a little bit quicker than what Gigliotti is, or stronger, one of the two. As Midal's got the ball, into Dada, Fakir, Gigliotti, goes around the man, shoots from distance, puts it over the bar. Good roll of the defender, but not very good on the finish. As Fakir's got the ball in the middle, Midal doesn't get onto it. Memphis has the ball now, into Kalesi, back to Gaspar, into Kalesi, where's he going? Around the man again. Back in the middle for Dardo, he's got a couple of men to pick, Danilo, Memphis, looking for Gaspar, but Kinnear um, clears it. We're playing the ball around very, very nicely. Memphis, Gigliotti, Danilo, Gigliotti, Kalesi, shoots some distance again, but he gets too far under it this time. And again, Another long shot as Handanovic clears it forward. Latter's going to challenge for it, but Kondreva gets in front of him, still gets the ball, but we make it back off him. Memphis, Fakir's not able to get on the end of that pass. Dada then plays it into Gigliotti. It somehow got through. I didn't see how we got through that challenge, but he has a decent shot on target and we get the throw in. I didn't quite see how it went through, but he got through somehow. I'm doing really, really well. I'm quite pleased with how we're performing at the moment as Fakir's got the ball edge of the box. Free kick over the top of the bar. And Fakir's not having the best of games at the moment. He's probably going to have to come off soon. So let's just tell him we're quite happy. What's going on yet? Oh, please keep going. Lovely job. Mario. Into Kondreva. Into um, Bengera. Kondreva, can he nick it off him? No, he's gone back to Nakatomo, or Nagatomo. Lato does win it though, Danilo, Dada. Oh, he's going to do something stupid there. Fakir, into Kalesi. 
got tons of space to move. Gigliotti, Fakir, shoots, it's hit the defender. And again, that was another decent opportunity for Fakir. Danilo Fakir, Memphis, lovely little warm touch pass into Gigliotti. Shoots out of the box again and still nothing sort of working. We're going to take Fakir off, but we're going to bring on Barco. And hopefully he can create something else. As Lato's got the ball into Dada, into Kalesi. Shoots on distance, saved by Andreva this time. That was a decent shot on target though. As Memphis is going to put the ball into the middle from the resulting corner. It's headed out. Gaspar's not in a rush to do anything with it. Into Mamana. It's wiped out by Perisic. So we got a free kick to whip in. Yeah, it's just a warning for that. So that's fine. Barco whips the ball in from right in the corner. Kalesi. Tackle. Barco picks it up though, but no one's in the middle. Barco's stopped it from going out from another corner. He puts it in the middle. Danilo can't get on the end of it. Dada, Lato. Dada. Danilo. Shoots. It's gone out. I was going to say gone out for Gaspar, but I thought he was going to get that before it went out um, for throwing. And we had a few more highlights this second half than we did in the first. And not a lot's really happening now. They made a couple of subs brought on Barbosa and Jogatic. Nagatomo, Barbosa, Gabriel. Why am I saying Barbosa? They've hit it into Dada, Memphis, Barco, tackled by Brogovic, Marilo, long ball forward. Mamana heads out. Glessi wins ahead, but no one's there to claim the third ball. And this it's starting to. Um, peter out we're not really getting a lot of decent chances into Danilo Memphis Kalesi it's got to Memphis saved by Andreva Andranovic or whatever his name is and if we don't win this I feel like we've been hard done by because we've dominated this game completely Gigliotti's put it in it's gone to Barco to the box tackle Gigliotti again into Kalesi tackle but we can't get, seem to get there Gaspar, that's fine. All the way back to Lafont. Complete dominate. They've had three shots all game. And we've headed it clear. Gigliotti can get there, that's fine. Into Kalesi. Still going. Down to Gaspar. You've got tons of space. Can he find a ball in the middle? No, he's gone to Dada to Danilo. Shoots. Saved by Dranovic again. And we're finding tons of space. There's not making any sort of really really good decisions. Gigliotti puts it in but saved by Dranovic. And we're not really doing a lot here. Yeah like we've had 22 chances to their three and I feel like we completely deserve to win this. We've dominated the game completely. Barco, Danilo, Memphis, it's wiped out by Kondreva who's going to get another talking to that should be a second card if it's not there's a problem it is a second yellow he's sent him off and they've gone down 10 minutes they've switched their they've dropped the centre mid attack out Gigotti shoots with nowhere near the goal oh excuse me as Mario gives it to Barbosa shoots saved by Lafont fine with that one Where's he going? Long ball for Memphis goes up. Danilo into Kalesi. Gigliotti. Through the, ball, through the middle for Barco. Saved by Andranov again. He's kept them in this. He's been one of their better players. As Memphis puts in the corner again. It's cleared out. Well, only as far as Memphis. So he goes for a second attempt. We've got 26 chances or shots in this game. And we've only scored one goal. We've been exceptional in terms of going forward, just not clinical. Lato heads it out, Morello into Danilo, Barco, around the corner for Gigliotti, shoots, saved by Andranovic again. And we are really struggling to find the back of the net, but luckily we've already found it, so I'm not too worried. We could do with a second just to 
guarantee this. Memphis Dada at the Lato, who doesn't get there. Hmm. That should, in theory, be about it. We shouldn't really get anything else now. It's coming up to the final whistle. Memphis nicks it, or doesn't. Jogatic has got the ball on the edge of the D. Not the D, the semi centre circle. Panera's got the ball. Two men come across, claim that's fine. And we win the Europa League. How did we do that from the start of the season? We win the Europa League, which is not something I was expecting to do. Um, wow. We're, I'm very pleased with that. Not something I was expecting, but we win the Europa League. Very, very pleasing result. And after that sort of run, sort of dropping off in the middle here, picking up a couple of losses along the way, to come back and not thinking I was going to get through some of these games, to come through and then win it. It's like, yes, thank you. So, yeah, we've won this. We finished third in the league. Disappointed on that note. Wanted to be a bit closer to Monaco and PSG, but they've got such quality squads. squads. And to win the Europa League, very, very pleasing. Can't ask for more for this season. And that's really where we're going to end this um, series off, guys. But if you have enjoyed it, smash the like button and the subscribe button. And I believe I'll see you next time for the start of FM18. Which I don't know what I'm doing yet in terms of saves. I still haven't decided. I've got a few ideas, but we'll see. We've got another month or so yet. Plenty of time to work it out, so thanks for watching. I'll catch you later, guys.